Today we're going to walk through the setup and use of the electric gear wheel. First, we put the belt on. Next, we attach the leader yarn to the bobbin. A little piece of scotch tape prevents the leader yarn from spinning. The next step is to put the bobbin onto the flyer. Then we weave the leader yarn through the flyer hooks and use the orifice hook to pull the yarn through the flyer. It's a little magnet on the electric gear wheel that holds the orifice hook. The brake in the back adjusts tension, uh, which controls the number of twists per inch and the uptake of the yarn. Now we're attaching the roving to the lead yarn. Turning on the spinning wheel and adjusting the speed. Here's a close-up of the controls. We just showed forward spinning, which is used to spin the yarn. If you want to ply yarn together, just flip the switch to reverse and start plying.